Hello, welcome to InfoIA. Today, I am going to talk to you about the dog breed Pug. The Pug is a small and adorable breed that has become very popular in recent years. Do you know why? In this video, I will tell you everything about the origin, characteristics, personality, and care of these very special dogs. The Pug is a very old breed that originated in China more than 2,000 years ago. It is believed to descend from a type of small mastiff that was highly valued by Chinese emperors. The dogs were treated as members of the royal family and lived in the palace with all kinds of luxuries. Over time, the Pug spread to other Asian countries and then to Europe thanks to trade and travel. In the 17th century, the pug arrived in Holland and became the symbol of the House of Orange, a Dutch royal dynasty. Later, the pug also became popular in France and England, where it was adopted by many famous personalities such as Napoleon Bonaparte or Queen Victoria. The Pug is a small but sturdy dog that measures between 25 and 30 centimeters in height and weighs between 6 and 10 kilograms. Its coat is short, soft and shiny and can be black or fawn, light brown with a black mask. Its most distinctive feature is its wrinkled face with a flat nose and large bulging eyes that give it a very sweet and intelligent expression. Its ears can be rose-shaped, folded back, or button-shaped, folded forward. Its tail is curly and curls over its back. The pug has a very cheerful and affectionate temperament. It is a very sociable dog that gets along well with everyone, children, adults, other dogs, and even cats. It loves to play and have fun but also knows how to be calm and obedient when needed. It is a very intelligent dog that learns quickly but also can be stubborn and headstrong if not trained well from puppyhood. The pug needs moderate exercise every day to stay healthy and happy. It is not a dog suitable for intense sports or for being in the sun for a long time because it can suffer heat stroke due to its flat nose. The pug tends to gain weight if it eats too much or if it does not exercise enough. You have to control its diet and give it quality food suitable for its size and age. The pug requires regular brushing to remove dead hair and keep its coat clean and shiny. You also have to clean its facial wrinkles carefully to avoid infections or skin irritations. The pug can have respiratory problems due to its flat nose. You have to watch out for its snoring or excessive panting and go to the vet if it has difficulty breathing or frequent coughing. The pug can have eye problems due to its bulging eyes. You have to protect them from dust, bumps or wounds and go to the vet if it has excessive tearing, swelling or eye discharge. The Pug is an ideal breed as a pet for people who are looking for a faithful, fun, and intelligent companion. It adapts well both to living in apartments and in houses with garden as long as it has enough attention and affection from its owners. It does not need much space or much exercise, but it does need a lot of company and affection. 
The pug is a dog that falls in love with its family and that does not like being alone for a long time. If left alone, it can suffer separation anxiety and develop destructive behaviors or excessive barking. The pug is a very special breed of dog that has a long history and unique physical and personality characteristics. It is a small dog but with a big heart that can fill your life with joy and fun. If you are thinking of adopting a pug, I recommend that you research more about the breed and that you consult with a breeder or a responsible shelter that can give you more information and advice on how to care for your new friend. And if you already have a pug at home, tell me about your experience with him. What do you like most about him? What tricks or games have you taught him? What problems or difficulties have you had with him? Leave me your comments below and don't forget to subscribe to my channel to see more videos about dog breeds. See you next time.